Hey there, fire signs. All right, let's get you some messages for the next 48 hours for all fire signs. The next 48 hours. Let's see for the next 48 hours for all fire signs. What's going on? Next 48 hours for all fire signs. What's going on? Okay, so we have the seven of wands. Okay, so fire signs, you're feeling very defensive. Okay, or feeling like you need to defend your positions. Okay, yeah, so you're defending your position towards another fire sign maybe. Okay, this could be someone that you have a relationship with. I feel like someone's trying to hold you close, okay, or keep you close. All right. I feel like also someone's trying to gain in on your secrets. Someone's trying to have heart to hearts with you. But I feel like you're like, what do you want? Like, I feel like you're very defensive. You don't want to welcome someone's energy in. Yeah, this could be someone that's asking about your relationship or asking if you're dating someone still. I feel like you're like, mm, why are you even wondering? Get out of my face. Like, yeah, I feel like you're very, yeah. I feel like you're, okay, so you could be out doing your own thing. Okay, being happy. Um, I feel like you just got out of a relationship or you just got out of something that was very unstable. And I feel like emotionally you're just very defensive this could be someone hitting on you i feel like someone could be like hey what are you doing like you know this could be a capricorn Taurus, or a virgo okay this could be a leo that they're coming towards maybe um i'm getting strong leo energy so someone's maybe finding a leo attractive and like oh are you still dating are you still talking to this person and you're like why is that in, in any of your business i feel like someone's just like in your face like okay whether you're a masculine or feminine you're someone's just being nosy about you and your life and i feel like you just don't like it right a lot of communication a lot of talking i feel like also you're getting a sense of distancing yourself i feel like you're on the highway um be careful of texting and driving okay but i feel like you're on the highway just kind of listening to music talking to people on the phone i feel like you're in a very busy state but with the death in the reverse okay i feel like there is um okay so i feel like also there's someone maybe messaging you or texting you um I feel like you're not wanting to end. Okay, so you could have a third party. There's someone out there that's dating three people or two people. I feel like you're texting them, talking to them, really interested in seeing what they got going on. Yeah, with the three of swords. I feel like one of these people, um, you tried to dead them, okay? So you could have been in a relationship. You had maybe someone in a third party. Yeah, you were a little high priestess. You knew what you was doing, but you ain't tell nobody. Yeah, with the two of wands. I feel like now things are kind of... I feel like you're over the situation or you don't want you don't you're trying to decide who you want to end communication with because I feel like someone okay so you could have been in a main relationship and you had two sides okay I'm getting maybe a masculine or feminine doesn't matter okay men or women okay they lie but energy does not okay yeah so someone's feeling a little heartbroken I'm hearing I lost one of my best hoes okay so you could be texting one of your best hoes while you're on the highway trying to see what they're doing yeah I'm hearing you have a lot of selfish ulterior motives I feel like you want to do a lot of things for your gain the next 48 hours okay i feel like it's just because you can like fuck it i don't give a fuck like i'm gonna do it right with the ace of cups i feel like uh also um I feel like you're realizing even though you walked away from someone or even though you just met you you used someone for just intimacy someone was or you just using you for intimacy you're realizing how much can like I'm I'm hearing like you have a very an intuitive energy with someone when you text them they're texting you when you call them they're calling you I feel like when you're on the phone they're like whoa I was just thinking about you like you were just on my mind what are you doing like I feel like someone you're realizing how much of a connection um maybe spiritually that you have with someone is kind of what I'm getting yeah yeah, with the six of cups flying out even though you're single and doing your thing and you want to be selfish you can't help but kind of still gravitate towards someone because it, i'm hearing they're your comfort zone or they just they're very emotionally understanding i feel like fire sign you maybe haven't met someone that emotionally understands you as much as maybe i'm getting maybe it's a water sign a pisces cancer or a scorpio there's someone that really understands you or makes you feel comfortable within your mind i feel like you don't feel like a crazy person strong cancer energy is what i'm getting for this person i feel like you could be in the car with them I I feel like also you guys love having car conversations whoever this is you love talking in the car with them or i feel like you maybe take l rides with them you'd be smoking with them or going on errands okay i feel like this is someone that you you love being around okay i feel like also this person has money okay they really want to take care of you i feel like someone's also trying to get down to the nitty-gritty of if they can be that person for you i feel like they're wanting to have more clarifying conversations okay i feel like also something about work okay make sure um 
if you are looking for another job or if you're looking to start new endeavors within work, literally with the Ace of Cups coming out as I'm saying that, make sure you're doing it for the highest intentions or that it's going to get you somewhere. So I feel like fire signs, sometimes you guys do things just to get by or I feel like you're taking on jobs just because you need the money. But I feel like there's no longevity in anything that you're doing. And even though it makes you happy, I feel like in the long term, it's going to blow up or there's always something shocking that's going to come um to, to bring it to an end right okay but that's kind of what i'm feeling for you let's see what's going on in love let's see what's um strongly going on in love for the next 48 hours for all fire signs okay yeah we have release your ex the time has come to clear your energy so there's someone that you were in a relationship with that um some uh, some um i'm hearing sagittarius okay so you probably i feel like um there's someone that you have a hard time really letting go of this could be someone that you have kids with you don't want to let someone go but you know it's about that time okay i'm hearing i'm wasting time at this point right with the free yourself energy it's time to take control back of my life like i feel like you're just like i can't keep letting this motherfucker in if they're not going to give me anything right i feel like that's all you've been doing you've been being hopeful but i feel like someone just does not show you what you need i feel like also because you're hanging on to that ex i feel like you're now ready to give a relationship a chance or give another person a chance i feel like again it was an intimate conversation it was an intimate situation situation you were just sexually being with them but i feel like now you're transitioning to the fact that you actually give a fuck okay you're realizing okay sex doesn't only make babies or makes you feel good but it makes you feel connected to someone okay i feel like you're realizing that flirting getting yourself back out there yeah i feel like also i'm hearing a, an ex is an agony seeing you go and do you okay someone does not like it someone actually hates it okay yeah because we have this could be the one worth waiting for someone's like even i feel like you broke up with someone or, or i feel like you parted ways either way okay whether you broke up or they broke up but you parted ways with someone and i feel like they're having a hard time accepting that because they feel like out of anyone they're trying to flirt with or be with you're you're the only fucking one right i feel like also um someone your ex is i feel like flirting with people for financial reasons or just to create some type of stability in their life because i feel like um you were maybe that stability for them okay yeah but very soon you have to clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you now make sure you continue to pay attention to the red flags that the signs are being shown to you from spirit okay i feel like a lot of entities coming in towards you are just based off of attraction or I I feel like a lot of people are seeing you in a physical light, but they're not really wanting to get to know you, especially in the next 48 hours, okay? Yeah, I feel like your feelings are real and worth exploring if you're looking for love, so I feel like wait on that. I'm hearing don't settle or don't, like, waste your time, okay? If someone is literally hooking or trying to hook up with you for sexual reasons, then that's what they're doing, okay? Um, I'm hearing, uh, what is it? What was it? What's that saying? If a, if a dog is a dog if a dog if it barks like what oh that's saying if it barks like a dog and it sits like a dog it eats like a dog it's a dog okay that's what i heard if it barks like a dog if it eats like a dog then it's a dog okay if if they do this if if it if it quacks if if it if it quacks like a duck and walks like a duck it's a duck okay <laughs> don't fucking get fooled all right fire sign let's see what's going on show me what's going on for all of my um for all of my fire signs, what's kind of going on for your energies and what y'all need to know the next 48 hours? What's surrounding fire signs, Aries, Leo, and Sagittarius? The next 48 hours, okay, of their days, the next two days, what's going on the next 48 hours for all Aries, Leo, Sagittarius? We have, this love is only physical dependence, okay? So you're realizing that someone that is just physically there, maybe it's actually like for intimacy reasons, or maybe someone's physically, you need them there, their energy, you get anxiety when they're gone. And also maybe it's actual physical, like in the physical realm and in, in the actual world, this is only physical dependence. You need them because they need your car. You need them because... Um, they need your money you need them because you need them watch your kids okay you need them because you need somebody to eat with you you know you can't eat alone i feel like something is just a physical dependence there's no real maybe love here okay why we have brother energy okay so i feel like someone was maybe saw as a bro or i feel like maybe someone's like friend zoned in a way i feel like maybe um even when you were trying to just be friends with someone you wound up having sex with them but i feel like yeah we also have he slash she knows player energy uh-oh 
Uh oh. Okay, so actually as well, I feel like someone is talking to um their friend about you. Okay, so someone is maybe realizing that uh, either a female knows or a masculine knows about a situation that's going down. Okay, someone's maybe not being very um someone someone's being a player okay i feel like also someone tried to downplay the fact that oh yeah they're just my friend or uh, a female could be like uh, or a man could be like oh that's just my girlfriend or i feel like someone's like oh that's just my bro a girl but i feel like someone is like it's an actual physical connection someone found out about that right we oh we have you don't think i know what what you're up to uh-oh we also have um dom um dom uh dominon kinky sex with lots of dominant positions choking pulling hair pleasure equals pain for this person they love um dominating and submissive and sub uh, and submitting or their person to right we have i avoid anyone or anything that leads me to feel my emotions so this could be a scorpio for you okay fire sign i feel like this is someone that they care about you but i feel like um someone's like i know what you're up to like i feel like someone's trying to like get um answers out of you the next 24 hours or the next 48 hours why we have i need alone time intuition you are already uh you already have the answers that you are seeking yeah so the thing is uh -oh, okay so someone's definitely finding out that another right what that he slash she knows if it walks like a duck and it quacks like a duck it's a fucking duck if it walks like a duck if it craps like a duck it's a duck if it walks like a duck if it quacks like a duck it's a duck okay and that's like the, uh, the energy that i'm getting i just feel like you're really realizing that someone I feel like someone's also very avoidant of the feelings, avoidant of being true to themselves, right? We have um, when, okay? We also have savoring um, energy. This person maybe loves giving sexual or oral intimacy. They take time to play in your playgrounds and also taunting them turns you on. This could be a cancer. So strong water sign. This could be someone with a cancer or Pisces, sun, moon, or rising, okay? We also have boundaries. Firm boundaries are needed within this connection, is there something you want to tell me? Right, okay. So I do feel like fire sign, you're dealing with maybe a water sign out there. And I feel like you're really trying to put your foot down. You're having to put your foot down with someone, okay. I feel like also maybe there's a sense of you feeling like, again, that cancer or this water sign is a win. I feel like you want them over maybe someone that you, um. I feel like someone that you like to, like you wanted to downplay. Let's clarify this though. We have children. Children are important in this partnership. I'm committal. So this could be some about someone that you maybe have kids with. Okay, or someone that has kids doesn't have to. Close out now. It's hard for me to choose you or them. So again, I'm I'm still getting that third party energy that we got in the um in the beginning. But yeah, that's kind of what I got for you. That's the next 48 hours. Let me know how it resonates and I will talk to you soon. Bye.